Trick or treat. Wait, who are you even supposed to be? I'm Dina from The Last of Us 2. What? <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> you don't know? <laughs> Should we like come in or like? You should be like it's cannonball me. into the eggs. Ahoy! <laughs> 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 Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Would you like to introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Jocelyn. Uh, <laughs> you definitely already knew that. Yeah, and you guys know me as the face model of a different character in the last of us. Mm -hmm. We thought we would um, make a special little video for all of you because we love you so much. And I just feel like this would just be so much fun. So we're gonna do a Seder shot it. Um, and if you've not watched one of these videos, it's basically a Q and A, but if we don't wanna answer the question, then we'll be taking a shot of this lovely, Juice. <laughs> it's actually vodka. But um, I'll just say it's juice. Shall we begin? <laughs> Favorite sex position? <laughs> Take the juicer. <laughs> okay, that's not that <laughs> You're right. It's it's better than just like straight up vodka. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lovely. Okay, next question. What's the weirdest thing you have ever done? Probably being the face model for a video game. <laughs> Probably <laughs> this video right now. Do you love yourself? Yeah. Yeah, I mean like I have to work on it, but I, the answer is yes, I think. Yeah, I, I'm in the same way, I gotta work on it. Some days I don't, but you know, other days I try to, I think at my core I do. Yeah. But like, on certain levels I'm like, no, stop, be the fuck up. <laughs> True, yeah. I, I don't really know what that means, you know? Like, sometimes I'm like, I don't even know who I am, so. That's true. <laughs> how, do, how am I supposed to like love that? But I guess you have to do it anyways. And despite, okay, anyways, we're getting really deep, but it's like the second <laughs> question. <laughs> Did you feel overwhelmed or had anxiety after gaining popularity from The Last of Us 2? Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, yes, definitely. Yes. Like, like still. Mm-hmm. I'm still like, I don't know. Like, I, it's like a roller coaster. Like, some days I'm like, this is fine. I can deal with this. And other days I'm like, no, 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 no. It's we gotta stop. Everybody unfollow me. <laughs> <laughs> Just go through, like, delete all the followers. <laughs> like, when is it that you feel like you're like, oh, like, people are like watching me? Um, I think it's like, like, I, I recently stopped using social media as much. Like, I never really used it much. And then I, when I got found out, I, I started trying to use it more and engage. Just, because I was like, this is fun, let's just try this. Mm -hmm. But I recently stopped because I, I don't know, I was just like, every time I like post something, people respond and I don't know why, but that freaks me out. Like it's a totally normal thing to happen, mm -hmm. but it's just like, I just go through phases where I'm fine with the attention and then other times I'm just like, I'm good. Dang. No, I feel the same way because like, I always had it private until I was like, okay, like I am gonna make myself public. But for some reason, strangers felt different than like, a mass of people at once. Yeah, you? yeah, yeah. Like it doesn't feel like strangers if it's like 50,000 people, right? <laughs> I don't know, maybe not. No, I guess no, I just feel mean, like one person is more dangerous than like- Yeah, it's because one person's just like, I'm gonna single you out for no reason. At least it's like 50,000 people yeah. who love you for a reason. Right, yeah. 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 It's like, <laughs> uh, that's where it is. Yes, yes. It's like, not one person like, I'm coming for you. Exactly. <laughs> How were you chosen to be the character model? Um, so I think I've, I've told the story a little bit like on Instagram or not Instagram Twitter the other one and the only other the, the only, only other, other social media. <laughs> so I, I worked at Naughty Dog. I think most of you know that I uh, worked as a QA analyst on uh, Uncharted 4, and then I started doing VFX while I'm there, and I'm a VFX artist now. I don't work there anymore though. <laughs> and but one day I was on my lunch break, and one of the concept artists came up to me and she was like, you're Jocelyn, right? And I was like, yeah. And she introduced herself. She's like, so I'm working on a new character and Neil kind of wanted me to go around the studio and take reference of people for the certain look we're going for. Would you mind if I took some photos for you for this character? And at this point, I didn't know anything about The Last of Us. Like I, I knew that they were gonna make The Last of Us part two, but I didn't know what the story was or what was going on with it at all. And she was like, yeah, I was like, that sounds cool. She's like, come by my desk when you're done eating. 
and we'll talk about it. So I ate my lunch, <laughs> I, went, I went over to her desk and she told me about Abby. And oh, she told you about her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She told you about like the whole character. Name? Yeah, she told me like what she does. Like I knew right away like what the character does, what she, who she is, what she oh, looks shit. like, and she was like, maybe we'll just use like your ear or like your nose, oh. or, like your eyebrow, and like we'll pu we'll put it together a bunch of other stuff for the character. And I was like, yeah, no, that sounds so cool. Like regardless, and then eventually it just grew, and then I became the whole head. <laughs> First it was just my nose. <laughs> yeah, it was my ear and my nose. <laughs> Then it was also my chin. <laughs> That's crazy. It wasn't really. Like that. I just was like a regular actress. I they just um, my agent sent it to me and was like, uh, they want you to send some pictures in for this. I was like, okay, and uh, <laughs> then I did, and then I got called in and got more stuff scanned just to test it out, and then yeah, I yeah. mean that's. <laughs> That's why I'm sorry. What was your first reaction whenever you found out you'd be the face model? I was stoked that I got it, but I was still apprehensive because I didn't know what it was for. Like it was just, I thought it was like some small like independent video game and like that, and then they were gonna have like some like, you know, sexy scenes and I was like, oh shit, like what? <laughs> like, I don't know if I would want my face a part of like this thing that I don't. Know, have any control over like I don't know so yeah then they told me they told me what game it was and then I did my research I was like okay all right that's fine <laughs> all right that's cool then <laughs> I mean mine was just kind of like I'm gonna be in a video game this is so cool like when I told all my friends at the studio I was like guys you're gonna put me in the game and they're like okay yeah whatever <laughs> oh but the, no people were like no that's cool that's exciting like, right. I was like maybe maybe they won't maybe maybe they'll change their mind but this is really cool and it's because it's kind of like when, like, in my mind about it, I was like, oh, this is like, if you see an artist you really like drawing, and you're like, I love your art style, I want you to draw me. It's kind of like that, but like on the scale of like a multi-million dollar video game. Right. So I was like, oh, you want to just like make me a video game character and put me in like with some of the best artists in the world working on it. Like, I was like, hell yeah, put me in, I love it. <laughs> put me in, coach. Wow, <laughs> that's sick. Like, I never actually thought about it like mm -hmm. that. It's like a, a like somebody drew a good, nice picture of you, but in a different way. <laughs> right. When I when I went in, like they showed me um, the like initial sketches for Dina, mm -hmm. and like I kind of looked like it, and I was like, oh damn. So in my mind, it was always just like I felt kind of just like an accidental like face, oh, you know, like yeah. they just happen to match what they want, <laughs> which is true. That is entirely what I am. It's, it's all by accident. <laughs> Same on my end. Like they were looking for a certain look, and I saw like the initial sketches, and they, and they I can see where they got the I, like the thought that oh this face matches this one that we're thinking about. Right. But I wasn't like immediately like I don't know. I think it just worked out. I kind of forgot yeah. where I was going with that statement. Don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> I do that all the time. <laughs> do you hate Abby? Okay, I'm gonna be honest. Right now, I hate Abby, but I'm <laughs> literally two percent of the way through the game. Two percent, and I've been playing for like weeks. So <laughs> no, it's yeah. totally fair. <laughs> but I, know I have not finished it. But do you hate Abby? I don't. I, I I really don't hate any of the characters in the game. I did it. Oh, I want to. It's like I always knew what was gonna happen. Like I've known the story from the start, like before I played the game. Okay. So it's hard for me to like really immerse myself and be like, oh. no, fuck this bitch. Like I was just kind of like, right. Like I was like, wow, I can't believe. She like I knew what was gonna happen. Uh huh. But I still found myself wishing, it, like hoping it's not gonna happen. You know. Oh. So that's like, that's how you know it's a good. Yeah, exactly. Good. I was like, please don't. Like no, I know this is gonna, no matter what I say. But um, yeah, yeah I was like. I was like, damn, I totally get why people hate this character, but towards the end, I was like, no, she's all right. <laughs> okay. Okay, interesting. Damn. So she really survives for a while then. <laughs> Worst fear. Snakes. Snakes? Snake alone. Aneurysms. I don't, that's, that's probably not my worst fear, but I was just thinking, we watched a show last night and there, this dude just died of an aneurysm. I'm like, that's terrifying. It can come out of nowhere. Yeah, the, honestly, I never thought to be afraid of those. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Now you can like stay awake at night thinking about that. Cool. <laughs> I'm afraid of just like bad people. Yeah, people, I think people are like my biggest fear though. Yeah, like to be honest, I would not be afraid of the dark or like 
going anywhere in the world if it weren't for bad people. Exactly. Like, yeah, Sam. So, if you could change humanity's opinion on one thing, what would it be? I think I, well, I guess it's not really an opinion. I was just, like, if I could do one thing to humans, it would just be, like, to open their ears and their yeah. hearts to each other. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, if we could just listen to each other and then empathize, because you need both. But, like, that's not an opinion. That's not changing an opinion. I, I agree with you, though, but you put words to, like, what I was trying to like express I guess like I just want people to be more open and care about each other more yeah is there like an opinion all of humans share oh I I don't know I would like probably try and lessen everyone's like lust for money yeah that's I pretty that's a pretty like I think that's a good one too that's a universal good. opinion that like that's what if people could like people chill <laughs> um what was it like working with naughty dog oh it was great i love working at naughty dog i worked there for like a little over two years i worked on uncharted 4 and uncharted the lost legacy um i loved it it was great yeah i think i'm gonna take a shit no i'm just kidding <laughs> um no yeah they were great i loved it i like walked in I like, okay, I, if you don't, if you've never been in like a video game office, it's like literally like, it's like, I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> it's like a, I don't want to say anything offensive. No, you're not going to. It's, it's like a fun, kind of like a Disneyland for adults maybe? <laughs> like a good way to put it is, so when I, when I first started there and I was like, I went to a meeting and it was like, my dad like, texted me later like oh how was like work and I was like oh I went to like you know my first meeting it was cool and he was like did you ride a skateboard there because he just like knew that it was some kind of like literally yeah so I so people had scooters they they did. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about it's just, like automatically such a fun environment and then everyone is just so nice and like literally just chill great company good game <laughs> Biden or Trump not Trump. <laughs> mm, not Trump. Not Trump. Do you relate to or are similar to Dina or Abby in any way? Abby is like a lot more disciplined than I am. And she's like way more like driven, which is not something, I mean, I am driven in my own way, but it's, it's not <laughs> in I mean, my she, own way. I mean, she just got buffed to like enact revenge. That's not something I would do. <laughs> um, and a lot of those decisions she makes in the game are not something I would do I, I think I'm a lot more relaxed mm -hmm. than she would be. I can see that. There are things that I do like about her that I can see in myself. I don't want to spoil anything. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry. No, honestly, I only know I've only known Dina for like an hour or something, <laughs> or like a few actually. I've actually put quite a few hours into that game. Uh, I like her humor, like her sarcasm. She's kind of got an edge, you know. But I think she's braver than I am so far. Yeah, she's pretty brave. I think so. And I can definitely see like the similarities really? between you and her. Yeah. Oh shit. They definitely. By the way, I did not act in this character at all. So far, I think I've seen like you know a couple love scenes between her and Ellie, and it's not like ooey gooey love. They're like so like. Yeah, it's cute. I, they, like, I, that's like that's what I do. Like that's kind of how I am. Like they like rip on each other. Yes, yeah. there it is. They rip on each other. Like that's <laughs> my shit. <laughs> okay, are you single? Let me do that again. I was like getting chapstick <laughs> out of my pocket. Okay. Yes, I'm addicted. I'm sorry. Uh, you're making me wish I had some. Um, do you need your purse? <laughs> so far, <laughs> there's no way I'm going down the stairs. <laughs> okay, are you single? No, I'm not. <laughs> I think that I'm. No, I am. I Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Next question. What motivates you? With my work, I I just always want to be better. I uh, want to be able to like share my knowledge with my peers, I guess, like in the same way that they do me. Uh, I mm. want to make good art. That's a big one. I, I love making art. I just want to make better art. Um, I'm fully with you on that one. Mm -hmm. What motivates me? Uh, in general, <laughs> like what motivates me to get out of bed is different than yeah. I just gotta do it. <laughs> right. I know, like I'm pretty good about just like doing what I gotta do. Like I don't always feel motivated, so some days I'm just like, 
right. going through the motions and I think it's just on days like that you just gotta be like okay I just gotta get through today yeah maybe today will be tomorrow will be better for me like what like motivates me is I guess like just knowing that I've just got the one life so it's like whoa whoa well, I'm just gonna live like one shitty life. Like that's, that just sounds not ideal. And also like other people, like fully other people motivate me. Like I wouldn't, if I was the only person on the planet, like I would think I would like enjoy for five minutes and then I would actually kill myself. Like I don't care to do that. I think other people are the only reason life is worth like living in the first place because we all exist together and like that feels good. It's all about what feels good, right? So yeah, yeah. Also, like that second shot is taking effect. <laughs> so, <laughs> how tall are you? I'm five eight. I'm five eight. Yes. <laughs> Wait, let's stand up. Are you serious? Yeah. We're the same height. Oh wow. Wait. Is so they can't even see our heads? Oh, I think without your shoes, you guys would be. Like, oh my god, oh. that's crazy! <laughs> Wait, are Dina and Abby the same height? No, I think Dina's small. Because <laughs> Dina's small. I think yeah. Because I assume you would be small. <laughs> That's so funny. When I did the, I did the commercial trailer. When I got there, like the stunt people who had been working on the game for years were like, "Oh my God, you're like a big life-size Dina." <laughs> I was like, "Big? <laughs> like, yeah, you're like a giant Dina." <laughs> Okay, next question. Um, that's funny. I didn't know you did that. That's really cool, though. Yeah, yeah. But uh, literally, the commercial is like me smiling for a second, <laughs> and I feel like I did a terrible job too. It's like one close like, up, and I'm like, you piece of shit. <laughs> Some unpopular opinion. Do you have an unpopular opinion? I think I have an opinion that like could be classified as unpopular, but I, it's also low key popular. But I fully, like, fully believe we're living in a simulation. <laughs> Like, I was dead, like, dead ass. The world ended. What is, there's like a theory that the world ended actually in like 2012 or something, and then it's like some weird conspiracy theory. Right, I think I've heard like a theory. And then, and then like now we're just like living in like a split dimension. Mm. I know, I really <laughs> think that we're just a little experiment. And they're just fucking with us every day. Oh lord. <laughs> and it's getting worse. That's interesting. That's not what I was expecting. Oh, really? Like, wait, what did you expect? I don't know. It was like anything else. I was like, wow, okay. Um, like, I, anything else? I don't know if I have one. I mean, I'm sure I do, but you know what? I'm just gonna take a shot. <laughs> I thought of one. I just don't want to talk about oh, it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> You're making me look real dramatic. <laughs> You've mentioned that many of your beliefs changed. Are you still religious in any way? Because I mentioned that my beliefs changed and I was raised like Christian. Okay. So that's, I think, where this gets. But like, I think I saw that video where you talked about that. Oh my god, didn't you? The one that came out like right after the game came out? Yeah. Yeah, I watched that one. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna say, like, I, I would say I'm spiritual. <laughs> like, stigma around that word, I feel like it's just. <laughs> like, I the connotation that comes to saying you're spiritual. <laughs> but like, I, like there's no other, I don't know how to say it because it's like I'm not religious as in like subscribe to a like orthodox traditional religion at the moment. But I am not like, I mean obviously I just said that we're living a simulation. <laughs> Which like, but, but the, like even if it's not like a simulation type, like, I don't know. I mean if you believe there's like some type of God, like, then it, that's a simulation anyways, right? Like essentially. Yeah. Essentially. I don't know. Like, I believe there's more than just like what we think we know. That's yeah. that's what I, I believe. Uh, I, my kind of theory on it is we don't know and we're probably never gonna know, so don't I don't wanna stress out about it and as long that's as good. as long as people aren't using religion to like hurt other people, then I don't care. You can believe in God. Like, do right. Your thing. No, totally. I think that's like what I hate the most about it is it's just, mm -hmm. it feels like not only does it control people, but yes. it then like causes all of these millions of problems that like I probably just shouldn't even get into because. Yeah. <laughs> What's the one thing you go back to uh, to keep you happy when things aren't looking great? I can tell you, I go back to the fact that like every time that things are shit, like it always comes back up. Do you know what I mean? Like eventually mm -hmm. it gets better. It does. So it's like a roller coaster. But you know, the flip side of that is whenever it's good, it always goes back down. <laughs> so it's like, it's honestly a double edged sword. Like it goes both ways. But 
I do know that it's just always gonna. Yeah, I, I think mine's similar. Like I've I've been in some really dark times that I, I wasn't happy with, and so when things are not looking going the way I want now, I, I look where I came from and where I am now, and I think that really helps me. The progression, yeah, the journey. I miss the journey. Just like I think also remembering that like whatever you know about yourself or the world right now will change and expand. And whatever you're capable of right now, like you are actually capable of expanding your capabilities. Like I literally have to tell myself that. Cause you think you're like who you are and you think you're stuck in this box or like you think life is one way, but it's always changing. Like if there's anything like, especially like looking at your own journey, it's like, that's just what it's always gonna be. Like there's just always more, there's always more you don't know. Is it weird seeing your face with someone else's voice? Yeah, it's very strange. <laughs> that just came right out. <laughs> yeah, it's very weird. Um, Laura Bailey is very charismatic and like the way that she talks and like carries herself. And that's like when I watch Abby, I'm like, that's not, that's not how I am. <laughs> I'm not that smooth. <laughs> I mean, I got used to it after a bit, like while I played the game. Mm -hmm. Like at first I was like, that's me. Oh God, why am I doing things and saying things I normally wanted? That's me. And then eventually I was like, no, this is a, that's a character. That's Abby. That's, that's her. Right. Yeah, yeah, That separation is key. I feel like Dina is just so much older than me or something. And also like our bodies are different and stuff. So like it's hard to like think that that's me when I'm so not used to like most of the stuff she does. Yeah. It's also like fun though. Yeah. It's so weird and it's fun, you mm -hmm. know? It's like just something you're not used to. Oh, I definitely enjoyed like just looking at Abby and see, like watching her do things. I'm just like, Whoa. I definitely enjoy just like staring at Dina. Whoa. I think it's also weird cause it's like, I could have made that myself and maybe it wouldn't have been as weird, but it's unfolding before my very eyes, which is the weirdest part. Cause when your face is doing stuff, you've never seen it do. I feel like my brow is a lot more expressive. Your than, brows are more expressive than hers. Yeah, like the okay. way I like, like furrow my forehead and stuff and uh -huh. like, but I also like, there's this, I can't like do like this. I can't do it like where you put like, I can't do that. <laughs> Wait, you can't? I can't, I can't How did you, you so like, when get they scan, when they scan me, okay, I can't do like, you know when you like make side eyebrows where they go like that, uh -huh. I can't do that at all. Oh, uh, oh, and I was like, they can't go up. I'm sorry, right. they're like, okay, we'll fake it. Like, That's the hardest one though. Yeah, I can't. The Shannon said she was scanned for like the bottom half. Yeah, I think she's the, like, yeah, her mouth and the, it, that's not my mouth. Okay. I like <laughs> the little smile, like, I can't even do it because it's not my mouth at all. What's something about you that surprises people? I guess <laughs> I'm like a professionally trained ballerina. <laughs> so, like, really? <laughs> right, that's there awesome. we go. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Like, even when I was in middle school, I was like, yeah, I'm a, like a dancer. And they're like, what the fuck? Like, you're such a. No way. Oh, like, you show up to dance in like a bun and like pink tights and that. I'm like, yes. <laughs> like, I'm graceful and poised. <laughs> oh, dude, I would. The, that you're like into raves. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that surprised me. Guess. I'm a raver. I like going to raves. <laughs> What's your favorite curse word besides. <laughs> Besides, I think sometimes it's funny just to go piss. <laughs> just like piss. <laughs> just say piss. 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 Just like that. That's brilliant. When you're trying to do something. Piss. <laughs> I like shit. <laughs> shit. Shit. <laughs> shit. Not piss. <laughs> What's your favorite movie at the moment? I included the at the moment. At it's the not moment. of thank all time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right now, Hubie's Halloween. Really? <laughs> It's just, so good. Is it really we, like I put it? We put it on, and I was like, I don't know what's going on in this movie. I don't know. And then like we just, he, I know, it was it's so thing. quirky. He just like he like just like he was like I just want to see what happens. And, like my boyfriend does this thing where he'll just like fast forward through movies. Like he was oh, like I just want to get like a general idea. And so like we didn't watch. I know it's weird. We're honestly not big movie watchers, you and so skim right through them. Like I I I don't really watch movies. I read about them on Wikipedia. <laughs> But what? I really like I really like animated movies. Um, okay. Favorite movie though? I just watched the end of Evangelion finally, and that movie is. It's not really a movie. It's like three episodes. Evangelion. Oh. It's an anime. Oh. Okay. I like anime. Um, yeah, okay. I might get in trouble for this, but I really like the Evangelion like reboot movies. I'm sorry, anime fans. Please don't yell at me. Oh, I think shit. they're really good. <laughs> the animation's dope. Hmm. Yeah. Fine, you would know. Yeah. <laughs> what do you believe is the purpose of life? To enjoy it? 
Oh, that's a good one. I don't think there's any like set in stone purpose. I think the purpose of life is there really is no purpose. Just be happy. As, as happy as you can. These questions don't mix with podcasts. <laughs> like, I swear to God. I guess mine mine is like to love. I And I don't mean like get a husband and have a family. Because uh, that's not that's not it. No, like love is the, as of right now. I mean, I'm on my philosophical journey. So, you know, we're just where we are at the moment. I just, I really think it's about like other people. But I don't know, that's just what keeps me going. So did you know that you would be getting attention from this? Oh. And did Naughty Dog warn you that that might happen? Yeah. Um, <laughs> um, somebody who I was working with was like, people are gonna like know your face through this. Like you should like ride that wave. And I was like, oh. <laughs> and I was like, what? And they're like, yeah. I was like, okay. Oh. <laughs> I knew that it might happen. I can't remember a specific time somebody who said, hey, you might get some attention from this. Mm -hmm. But I'm, I know like coworkers or would, be, or would come up to me and be like, you're gonna be super famous. And I'd be like, yeah, right. I really didn't think people would be able to figure out it was me. And looking back, that's extremely naive. I don't know, like I just assume people would like see it, like wouldn't put, make the connection that like a video game character might be a real person. Yeah. Some dude on Reddit like, Oh. Like Googled everybody in the credits. Well, I think everybody in like the models section. Okay, okay, okay. And the way it happened was one day I took a nap, mm. and then I woke up and everybody knew who I was. <laughs> like, so like I I had been no getting way. like trickles of like Instagram follow requests. Then one like that day it just kept coming more and more and more often. And so I was like, oh, they might be realizing it's me because of they might be like, oh, that photo kind of looks like the character. And so I was like, I got it. I'm gonna make a new profile picture, and that's what I drew that little thing. <laughs> I went up to my boyfriend, and I was like, "Look, I ha I drew this little picture, and now nobody can find me." And he was like, "Why? Why did you do that?" I was like, "Oh, because you know I'm, I'm getting a little bit more follow requests right now, so th they're figuring it out based uh, on the picture." Yes, 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 and then he yes. goes to the computer and just like Google's me, and then it's just like immediately on Reddit. It's just like my face. They're like, "Oh, this girl was the like the face model for Abby," and I was like, "Oh." That's how they found me. Oh my god, yeah, no, it always happens on Reddit. It's fucking Reddit. Reddit! Ah, oh, you guys are detectives. Then I tried to like ignore it for a few days because I was like, I'm not ready for this. Oh yeah. And then I eventually was just like, okay, yeah, it's me, I did it, I, Yeah. I'll try to be on here more. <laughs> for me, it was in like three different waves, I guess I would say, because it was like when the first trailer came out years ago. Mm -hmm. That was my first like wave. I was like a couple thousand and I was like, whoa! <laughs> the second wave was like, as the game was about to come out, I feel like. Because mm -hmm. I played the last one, the first one. Oh, that yeah. was another wave for me. But I did it right before the second game came out, so I was like... A lot of people were like... Yeah, yeah. and I was like insane for that. that at that point I was like 25,000 on YouTube and I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> then when the actual game came out, I was just not prepared. Yeah, you... Not so like I'm this is gonna sound so creepy the way I'm about to phrase this, but I've known okay. about you for years. Wait, really? Yeah, because I worked there and they were like, oh, this oh is a space model, you know? You and they talked about right. like how you went down and got scanned and all that. And so I've always kind of kept an eye on your socials because it was like a barometer for me to see how like how much attention I might get, to see oh. how much attention you were getting. Yeah. <laughs> so I've always like kind of watched like every few months I would check in and be like, how is Dina's face model doing? <laughs> One day I checked and it was this was a few years ago and you had like 6,000 followers on Instagram and then I checked like a little bit later and you had like 20,000 and I was like oh wow she you know she's really going and then and then like I think I didn't check for a long time until like after the game came out and you were like in the hundreds I was like oh my god really? <laughs> wow yeah, that's so that's insane how often are you recognized on the street oh okay literally never <laughs> but one time I was. <laughs> I was actually on my own driveway. Um, <laughs> some person was like working on our car, like the windshield had been shattered or something. And he was like, uh, hey, like you kind of look like this video game character. And I was like, oh, that's actually me, that's my face. And he's like, well, no way, my girlfriend's not gonna believe me. And I was like, fuck, you're actually on my driveway. You know exactly where I live. Like, oh, it's like, why did I, I could have just been like, yeah, that's cool. But I like. I don't know about video games. 
already talking about. <laughs> I haven't been recognized either because I don't go outside. And when I do go outside, I have a mask on, so. <laughs> right, true. But I did have a similar thing happen where a guy was delivering Postmates for my roommate and he saw that we have like some like Naughty Dog posters in our apartment and he was asking us about them. And he goes, did you play The Last of Us 2? And I was just like, excited and like he seemed really nice and chill and I wasn't concerned even though yeah, this person yeah, yeah, knows yeah. where I live right um because he was just like I love the game blah 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 you know it, and I was like and I took my mask off because I always wear a mask when I answer the door uh -huh. and I was like do you and he goes oh my god you're her <laughs> holy shit that's yeah. so cool and we just it was really cool we actually ended up following each other on Twitter and we had a long conversation about it he was super nice oh um, dang but yeah, that's that's the only time. <laughs> that's so cool. We've had like the same. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. That's really cool for him. Yeah, he was and he was like not like, oh my god, blah blah blah. He right. was just like, oh, that's cool. And then we just like talked oh, about really? it. Yeah, he was really chill. Um, he was like, oh, oh, you're her. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> why don't you post more? Slash, why are you like this? <laughs> I don't know. Social media is weird and it kind of stresses me out. And I never really used it that much before I got found out. Mm. And I went through a phase where I was like, okay, no, I'm gonna try this, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna post pretty regularly and try to drum up some uh, noise, I guess is the word. Hmm. And then I just kind of got bored of it. <laughs> oh, shit. And I was just kind of like, you know what, no, this is actually kind of stressful and I go through phases of like things that I'm interested in and things I want to do and for a while that was like gonna be on social media, like that was just like something I would do. And I was enjoying it for a while, and then I decided, like, no, oh, I'm not really enjoying this anymore. I'm gonna do something else with my free time. Yeah. I'll probably come back to it at some point. I'm not like abandoning it. It's just not really my thing to maintain it that much. I think that's the best part of social media is like when it's very tailored to the person, when it's like very personal, that's when it's like worth following. Yeah. You know I mean? It's like, that's, it's not like a machine. Yeah. It's not like a content producing, like, yeah. Just for the sake of producing it. When I like actually can give this like my time and attention and like when I have something worth like your time, that's yeah. when I'll give it to you. So I like that. Yeah, that's kind of how I feel about it. Like I don't, I'm not like doing anything interesting. I'm just like at my apartment. Like it's not like I can, I'm just gonna show you more photos of me in my apartment. Like, but, so yeah. like if I, when, maybe when COVID ends and I'm going out more, I can post more. Right. It's just like, I don't know, there's just nothing to share and I just kind of don't want to look at my phone that much and not that I have to, but I do look at social media. I just, but I just look at like art and like the news. That's and healthy. Like that. Yeah. That's healthy. <laughs> I'm not that healthy. <laughs> so, um, why'd you kill Jewel? I didn't. <laughs> oh, she didn't. I wasn't me. Are you as ripped as Abby in real life? Slash, do you work out? Uh, no, I'm not buff like Abby, but I do work out. <laughs> this uh, is gonna just be the most insane transition I've ever done. <laughs> <laughs> Should we have a muscle off? Yeah, maybe. That's it. Let me do some photos. Wait, this is my left arm. <laughs> They're fake. It's not like. <laughs> oh, it's not like I can never. I'm such a noodle compared to you. <laughs> oh my god, I'm actually gonna flex with Abby right now. This is. Okay, here Can we you go. imagine? Video Chuck E. Cheese, Chuck E. Cheese did a stream and he looks at the camera and he just goes, Hoggers. And it's just like the most cringy, hilarious thing I've ever seen in my life. I'm sorry, this is like a totally random tangent. No, I just wish I knew what you were talking about. Hoggers. Oh, wait, yeah, the question. Also, do you work out like Gabby? Uh, I don't work. <laughs> I do work out, but not as much as Abby. I just I just got my little hammer here. It's it's okay. It's for, just for protection. For but <laughs> you know, there's there's bad guys out there. Mm -hmm. There's clickers and stuff. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, but I uh, I do work out. I actually have a trainer that I work out with twice a week. She's really great. I, oh, dope. Because I not very motivated to work out on my own, which is something I need to work on and do better at. Uh, but she's great. She really helps me out a lot. She keeps me, holds me accountable for it and stuff. So that's cool. This is so insane. <laughs> Literally, I'm like, I'm just imagining those are real, you know? You're like, I have a trainer, like, she keeps me motivated. I'm like, as if. Like, you look at the gym every day, you're beast. <laughs> I mean, if you watch my channel at all, you know that, like, 
I, I like to, I like my, my leg days <laughs> and um, upper body days as well. So I, I, I feel like really lucky that I've like built this habit of going to the gym. But honestly, like it became more of like a mental stability thing rather than a physical like health thing. It's like, I just need to go and like kill myself for like an hour and that will keep me mentally stable. I feel you though, like, cause once I, like, I have days where my anxiety is really bad or I'm really stressed out and then yeah. I work out and I feel so much better. Right. Like, it's just, like, I still have those problems, but it's just, I'm not so right. like, amped up, you know? Right. It's like, it's my rock. And obviously I run too, so like that's, that's Ugh, running, I hate running so much. I need to start doing it again. Really? I just hate it so much. It's. I, I, I like going on the elliptical at the gym. But oh, all the gyms yeah, yeah. in LA are closed, so I can't. Um, <sighs> yeah. It's just hard on my joints. I know. Running is tough. Uh, the thing about running is like you have to go through this period of like everything just breaks, like your knees shot, shin splits. <laughs> like, you just gotta I, fuck I yourself. Up. <laughs> yeah. You got, I was like in like three ace bandages. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but then you get past it, and then you can just start running like miles and you're like what the fuck like <laughs> i'm elite like, i can just keep running that's what i was reading about the runner's high like a few weeks ago and that's i was like wait so i didn't realize it was a real thing i thought it was just like i feel good because i run i didn't realize you actually get like a that's so cool i'm sweating just so trying. bad in this room <laughs> I keep like forgetting that you're wearing it and i'll notice it you're like what the fuck <laughs> person who made this suit for me um, is L Fett on Instagram. It's E L underscore F E T T. He makes some really cool costumes, and you guys should go check him out. And he totally set me up with this, and he actually linked us up, so that's pretty cool. He brought he brought you this video. Yep, you should you thank, him. thank him. <laughs> thank you to him also. Thank you. So I'll put his name right here. Oh my god, am I already like getting sweaters? <laughs> Oh good, that means, no, that's a part of the costume. Is it really? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> but mine aren't. <laughs> okay, last question. How hard was it keeping Abby a secret? Or Dina a secret? Um, it was really hard. It was hard. <laughs> Cheers to signing NDAs. <laughs> I feel like such an alcoholic watching you drink. Oh god! <laughs> this thing where I torture myself by just leaving it in my mouth because I just can't so much. I'm like, mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's so much worse now. You know what? To be honest, it's not that. Like I can taste the. Yeah, now actually it. after a little bit, it's not. Bad. I think I was just like shocked because I was expecting it to be more. Than it actually is. Or all you were expecting, like, it's fruit punch. Yeah, I was expecting, like, soju or something, which I like, should have done. Mm. Next time. Okay, that one actually just, like. <laughs> <laughs> and that's that. Well, I okay, guess, thanks for watching. Thank you for coming. And I'll like, see you in the next video. <laughs> what did I say? That's pretty good. Do you have anything to add? Uh, thanks. Bye. I don't know, I don't really add. <laughs> Alright, sick. <laughs> I, I'm gonna pee my pants.